Welcome back to Abyssinia Stadium. I'm Shane Alexa alongside Brandon Bush. This afternoon, the Sals will take on C. Milton Wright. The Sals are coming off a big 6-1 win against their rival, St. Mark's. Brandon, what will the Sals have to do to keep that winning streak alive? You know, I'm feeling uh, we need Darius Gavris to control the field. Whenever we have Darius Gavris in control, it's really been a great game. So I'm hoping him and Brett Langer in the back can just hold things down.
Here is the Silesian starting 11. Zach Bittner in goal, Gannon Tomey, right back. Tanner Brentlinger, left center back. Brandon Ibarra Sanchez, the left back, left back position. Harris Pappas, left center mid. John Luca Maroney, right center mid. Justin Hines, right back. Darius Gavris, left center back. Aiden Gonzalez, attacking center mid. Sean Duffy, midfield. And Jake Ross at the forward position. And starters for C. Milton Wright High School, we have Charlie Adams at goalkeeper, Travis Kozak at defense, Drake Congrefun at midfield, Aaron Clark at defense, Matt Luke at offense, Samco Duraka at uh, midfield, Dominic Peter at defense, Evan Snyder at defense, Anthony Kettleson at midfield, Aiden Whitmore at midfield, and Gabe Cook at midfield. And that is the tap. They have something that pass. Trying to fight John Luca Maroney. See, Milton wouldn't have it. Maroney in the corner. John Luca Maroney. They win it back. Maroney trying to intercept that pass. There's Gavris, Darius Gavris. Trying to do the dirty work, Darius Gavris. Duffy. John Duffy. He's got Brentlinger. Brentlinger. Very Barra Sanchez. Foul called on Ibarra Sanchez. Play it upfield. The ball in the box. Save made by Bittner. There's Maroney. John Luca Maroney. Time and space, Maroney. Miscommunication there with Ross. He's able to keep it in. Good effort there from Jake Ross. Duffy for Tommy. Gannon Tommy. Play it back for Bittner. for Brentlinger. Tanner Brentlinger. Trying to find an AG. C. Milton wouldn't have it. Brentlinger. Back for Hines. Justin Hines. Brentlinger. Now it's amazing how calm Brentlinger can stay during this game. He always has nice passes, and even when the defenders are coming at him, he stays solid. See, Milton Wright's been pretty aggressive so far in this game. Yeah, um, I feel like they, they said this was a really big game for them, so hopefully they can do something early. Yeah, they haven't beaten Sally's in 20 years. Yeah. So definitely a big game here for C. Milton Wright. Uh, they're probably hoping to come out strong, get an early goal. Really um, assert their... Missed play by Brentlinger, though. Power. Wins it back. Bittner rolls it out for Hines. Justin Hines. Brentlinger, 
Boys in upfield trying to find Ross. Beautiful ball there from Brentlinger. Beautiful, beautiful touch there from Ross too. Pappas, Harris Pappas, making defenders miss. They win it back. Well done by Brentlinger. See Milton right in the pro. Duffy wins that one back. Shielding his defender. Brentlinger. Duffy gives it right back. Brentlinger trying to find Pappas. They played upfield. Sounds of a throw. Brandon Abarra Sanchez will take the throw. Ibarra Sanchez throws it in quickly. Ross trying to get the one two back to Ibarra Sanchez. Played well by C. Milton Wright. There's Tommy. Gannon Tommy. Tug of the shirt. No call. Hines wins it back in the corner. Job well done there from Justin Hines. Pappas, time and space, Paris Pappas. Pappas, trying to send AG. See Milton Wright wouldn't have it. There's Aiden Whitmore. Whitmore, trying to win that one back. Draws his team a foul. Both teams looking very aggressive so far. Defenses are holding up though. Oh, played up field. The header from Duffy. Chested by AG. Cook lost it. Duffy to Gavris. Great pass. Trying to send Pappas down the line. Well done by that defender. Bittner for Brentlinger. Gonzalez. Duffy mistouched it. Good effort there, though, from Sean Duffy. And C. Milton Wright will have a throw. Gavris for Hines. Back for Brentlinger. Ibarra Sanchez trying to make a run. They see him, Ibarra Sanchez. For Duffy, Pappas making a run as well. Harris Pappas. Back for Duffy, Sean Duffy. Gonzalez, Aiden Gonzalez for Ross. There's Cook. Duffy wins it back, trying to send Ross. Too much on it. C. Milton Wright has a goal kick. Adams plays it upfield. There's Peters. Good step there from Ibarra Sanchez. So far, it doesn't look like any one team is dominating. So, this could be a fair game. 
Peters the throw. Luke shielding defenders. Well done from Tommy. Maroney mistouched. Hines for Brentlinger. Justin Hines plays it upfield for Maroney, for Duffy, Sean Duffy. Sean Duffy's on today. His passes and moves have been great. Trying to find Ross. Well done by C. Milton Wright. Bittner for Brentlinger. Good cross field pass for Hines. Pulling around with it in the back. Pappas, the turn. Trying to find Ross. Jake Ross. Taking on defenders, Jake Ross. Blocked. The Sal's have a throw. Ibarra Sanchez will take that one. Gabris for Maroney. Maroney from distance. Blocked. Tommy wins it back. Gannon Tommy. Gonzalez the shot. Just wide. <laughs> Quinn Van P, along with many subs that'll come on for C. Milton Wright. McBriars will come in for Milton. C. Milton, right? Yeah, you'll see on that replay, AG just missing that one, just wide. Go, Sonny! <laughs> Peters. Dominic Peters. Pass intercepted by Gavris. Maroney. Has time and space, John Luca Maroney to Ross, through ball, couldn't control it. AG trying to get the rebound. Beautiful tackle there. That was Matt Luke making that tackle. There haven't been any more any shots on goal um, this half. It's about 13 minutes into the game. Looks pretty even. Both teams playing well on offense and defense, but there haven't been many shots on goal, so we'll see how that goes. The Sals have yet to test Jake Adams. Maroney, Gavras for Pappas, has time and space, Paris Pappas for Duffy, Sean Duffy, Gavras, Darius Gavras for Pappas taking on defenders, Duffy, Sean Duffy, Duffy the shot, just wide, good effort there from Duffy. Yeah, it looks like Gavis really is fulfilling that uh, central player position right now. Um, doing a nice job of switching field, passing, in the ball where it needs to be. Peters. They play it upfield. Brentlinger. For Duffy. Quick turn for Gonzalez. Great passing there from the Sals. 
Ibarra Sanchez. Peters wins that one back. Plays it upfield. There's Hines. Maroney for Tommy. Again and Tommy. Tommy draws a foul. Gavris. Big Duffy wanted him to switch the field. Beautiful ball there. The shot, just wide. Aiden Whitmore with the shot there. Good effort there from Whitmore. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. For Ross. Gonzalez trying to find Ross. Jake Ross trying to run onto that one. South of a throw. Slazingham's execution of their passes and moves have, has just been amazing tonight. Today. Tommy for Hines for Brentlinger Tanner Brentlinger C. Milton Wright giving him a lot of time and space trying to find Gonzalez they wouldn't have it Brentlinger wins it back though Duffy Sean Duffy for Ross Jake Ross trying to find A.G. Shot! Great save there from Adams. Strong pair of hands. Duffy's really been everywhere on the field so far. Yeah, I think this is the best game I've seen from him. Yeah, not starting the past couple of games. He's been out. Came on as a sub against St. Mark's. He's been dealing with a side hip issue. Well, looks like he's back and playing great. Good to see him back in there. For sure. Hines for Maroney. John Luca Maroney. For Gonzalez. Oh. Tackle there. You ever slide tackled there? Not too happy about that. Ref having a kick. talking to him. That was Sam Dragunas. Tommy. Gannon Tommy. Great play from him. Looks like it's going to be a right kick. Goal kick. Adams plays it upfield. Ross trying to win that one back. Gavris, Darius Gavris, good step there. Great interception, that could have been a Sally's goal. There's Drake Gunas. Hines the header. We get a bit of a push there. It's gonna be a Sally's kick. Bittner takes it quickly. Maroney trying to find Ross. Jake Ross! Ooh. Foul called. Well done by Adams, though, to come off his line. That could have been physically dangerous for that goalie diving in like that.
Adams plays it upfield. Luke battling with Hines. Hines wins the battle. AG Gonzalez for Papas. Maroney trying to pull off some Maroney magic. Shot is blocked. Duffy, Sean Duffy for Gonzalez, for Ross. Shot just wide. Adams has a goal kick. Yeah, with the amount of uh, shots that Sally's has had, it's just a matter of time until one goes in. Peters. Papas wins it back. Peters getting a little handsy there. Drake Congrefon will come on. Looks like Zach Freeberger and Connor Skirty will also come in. In addition to Paula Magat for Louisiana. Tyler Sifa will come on. Duffy. Back to Hines. Ross. Beautiful touch there from Ross. The shot hits the post. It hit the inside of the post and somehow stayed out. Yellow card? Yeah, it looked like it, it, looked like it may have gone in. Refs did not call it. Is that a yellow card going on down there? Looks like Papas has a yellow card. Looks like it may have gone in. Hit, looks like it hit the tire. about that one. But we do have Colin McGee in the game, officially. This could be big. It did indeed hit the inside of the net, hit the tire. Was indeed a goal. The refs will talk about it. Meanwhile, Paris Papas getting a yellow card. Looks like Gabbers and Papas are out. One due to a yellow card, one due to Coach's call. Um, I think McGee and definitely Sifa went in, in there. For them. Well, it doesn't really matter if it's what the ref calls, so we'll see. Great so replay there from our crew. Doesn't look like they're going to call a goal. But with the amount of shots Lazing has had, it really feels like they are dominant at this point. Zach Freeberger and Connor Skirty will come in the game. We play on, no goal. And 
Coach Mosier with the yellow card and another coach with a red card. Coach Romano has been booked from this game. This is an incredible performance. I mean, the ball went in the goal, but we can't really do anything about that. So Coach Moser is on a yellow card, and Coach Romano has been booked from this game. Still nil-nil, about 20 minutes remaining in this first half. No goal, we play on. Duffy, Sifa, Tommy, the shot, Ross. Looks like Slee's gonna be coming out even harder after that. Ran into the post, couldn't finish the rebound. Sanchez for Gonzalez. Duffy. Fires wins it back. Ball there. We'll take it quickly. Ross to the outside of his foot. They win it back. They'll play it upfield. Brentling with the header. Duffy going up for it. Hines. He's got Brentlinger for McGee. He wins his team a free kick. Maroney, John Luca Maroney, showing off his skill. Ibarra Sanchez, corner. back with Deep. even more aggression. Ibarra Sanchez, the shot deflected. Gonzalez. Sifa. Duffy. McGee. The ball in the box, headed away. Luke. Matt Luke. Luke. Beautiful ball there. Bittner coming off his line. Great save there from Zach Bittner. And that was Drake Congrafun with the shot. Looks like Bittner did not get a deflection on that one. Great job though coming off his line. You're playing really well. Great job on 
Looks like Sladen is really trying to get that goal back. Really want to take the lead. Looks like they're playing even more aggressive. They were playing great before, but now they're just all playing up. Yeah, you'll see here on this replay, great job here from Bittner coming off strong. Made himself look real big. Great job there from Bittner. Yeah, that was a great save. It was a one-on-one -on -one right in front of the goal. Still didn't save it. Somehow did not go off of him. But still a great job there from Bittner. Brentlinger for Hines. Must just be the intimidation of a goalie sliding at you, I guess. Had no time to think. Maroney, John Luca Maroney has time and space. Maroney for AG. AG the shot, just wide. Yeah, we've seen some great shots from Slazianum so far. One of them might have gone in, but. We know one of them did go in. Yeah. <laughs> According to the ref, it didn't, so. Still 0-0, but Salis is really dominating so far. See Milton Wright with a little help of the refs hanging in this game. Maroney for Ross. Ross, quick turn, Jake Ross. Yeah, I was just going to say, Jake Adams, who is uh, C. Milton Wright's goalkeeper, is really playing very He's been really solid back there. He's kept his team in this game. Peters, they'll play it upfield. Hines, back for Bittner. Yeah, Bittner hasn't had much, as much of a chance to show off his skills, but when he has, he's been playing great too. Hines for Duffy. McGee trying to play it up the line. Sal's on the throw. McGee gonna take the throw? Maybe not. Looks like it's Tommy. Tommy for Duffy. Ball intended for Ross. Great block from Aaron Clark of the right school. Beautiful tackle there from Sean Duffy. Duffy winning that one back. Duffy continues the great game he's been having. Gonzalez for Maroney. John Luca Maroney. The shot. Right at Adams. Another great shot. A lot of velocity on that shot. Yeah, and most of Slazian's uh, shots have been on goal. It's not like they're missing, so it's just the goalkeeper blocking. Gonzalez in the corner. Aiden Gonzalez Great showing footwork. off some skill. Gonzalez, the cross, right at Adams. Another one. Rolls it out quickly. Intercepted by Brentlinger. Tanner Brentlinger. Ross, Jake Ross, the shot, just wide. It's almost like Slazian is averaging more than a shot on goal for a minute. Darius Gavris will come back in for Slazy Anum. Aiden Whitmore will come on for C. Milton Wright. And that's Brandon Abera Sanchez coming off for Slazy Anum. Gavris will take his position back. Adams. Short ball for Peters. Well done by Brentlinger. And that should be a sleeve in the gold kick. minutes remaining in this first half. Brentlinger. Duffy. 
Beautiful from ball McGee. there from McGee. The ball in the box. McGee. Duffy, the shot. Great shot there from Duffy. Just this wide. really is the best I've seen him play. Even though he has a nice Great job by Adams to cover his ground. Yeah, that shot was not on goal, but it still wasn't. He made the effort to dive. The flick of the head. Sifa, the header. Maroney. Gonzalez has his back. No call. Nuridin. Crossfield pass intercepted by Tommy. Great interception. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. Back for Tommy. There's Gonzalez, quick turn. Aiden Gonzalez for Ross. The shot, beautiful save there, the header. Wow. Wow. They have a really great goal. Wow. Jake Adams absolutely robbing Silesiano as, he's, as he keeps his team in this game. Yeah, I'm very impressed by that. That took some skill. Quick shot from Ross, quick turn. Beautiful kick save from Adams. And then he gets right back up and saves that header. Yeah, it's, it's crazy to say that. Wonderful job there from Adams. The star player right now. McGee. Really the ball in the box. Nuridin. Maroney. Back for Brentlinger. Good touch there from Brentlinger. Gavras. Darius Gavras. Plays it in. Beautiful tackle there from McGee. Gavras. Good cross field pass. AG in the corner. Shielding his defender. AG. Back for Hines. Harris Pappas about to come on in this game. Brentlinger. Foul called. We'll test Adams once again. Gavers playing the left side of the field, which is unusual. Usually he's in the center, playing center mid to the commanding field, but he has come in for Brandon Bear Sanchez, who plays left center back, I believe. So maybe he'll have a different role in the rest of this game. Tyler Sifa will take this free kick. Surprised Ross isn't taking this. Maybe he needs a breather. Adams setting up his wall. Looks like a wall of four. Sifa, the shot. Great save there from Adams, the rebound, kick save. McGee with the shot, couldn't get it in. Corner, wonderful job from Adams. Makes the original save, rebound, and he, he stones, really and he stones McGee. Beautiful kick save. And that, and that guy takes the skill to block an upshot shot from McGee like that. He stopped almost every player on this team from taking shots at the defense. I've seen shots from Duffy, Ross, McGee, Gavris, etc. And he's blocked everything. Papas will take the corner. The ball in the box, headed away. Oh my God, in there for the first time today. Hines, Duffy the shot. Another. Rebound, they clear it away. Jake Adams, another save. Agat throws it in quickly. Duffy. Papas, the shot. Saved by, saved by Adams. Yes, yeah, Elysium defense really hasn't had much of a job to do. They haven't had the ball much, but that's usually a great thing, but Elysium can't get the ball on the goal. Adams not happy with his defenders.
he's, he's almost saved close to 30 shots this game. And they've all been great. Punched out by Adams. Gavris, the ball in the box. Maroney, the header. Great job there from Adams. Pappas is the corner. He's got Gonzalez short. Pappas, the ball in the box. Headed. Another save. Adam stones him. Looks like we're gonna go right back. We need a second chance on this. Let's see what they can do. Jake Adams keeping his team in this game. Adams. Goal kick. If you're Moser right now, there's really not much you not can much do. Not much you can do. You can't really his, ask his for anything team is else. Not Slazy Adam is playing great. It's just the goalkeeper. <laughs> the goal I mean, the game could be 10-0 right now if this goalkeeper wasn't that good. The only thing you can do is keep doing what you're doing. I mean, just yeah. keep getting shots on him. I mean, he's, he's proved. Even like on double shots where he blocks one, he still can see. Yeah, those second. rebounds have been fantastic. He's been fantastic on those impressive. rebounds as well. And I believe there's only been one shot on goal for Wright School. Score still 0 0, though. It is a nil nil game, as you just said. I mean, C. Milton Wright gets a counterattack, they score, they're winning this game. And so Easy Anum has absolutely dominated this game. So far in this first half. Yeah, and it's not just like Jake Ross is just a good player. He's one of the best scorers in the entire United States. Gavris. This kid saved 15 of his shots or something like that. Dolphy. <laughs> Gavris. Maroney wants it. I mean, all Mosier could really tell him to do is, I guess, shoot for the corners, but. A lot, of the, a lot of the shots have been directly at the keeper, even though he has made some great saves. So maybe some quick passes at the end, get in the corner. That could be their method of scoring, but I'm not really sure what to do here. I mean, you're taught to play just really simple as possible, but, but I mean, maybe at times, even here, I mean, the keeper's been unbeatable. Maybe you gotta be a little fancy. Yeah, even high shots. Corner shots, anything. There he Saves is again, all. beautiful punch there. Magat the rebound, shot blocked. Brentlinger will play it back for Tommy. Tommy, the ball in the box. Right at Adams. It is reassuring though to know that even if um, right school does get through, we have Brentlinger in the back. He's been playing amazing as usual, but. Might end in a tie if it stays this way. Coming up, I think under two minutes. We're in extra time right now, we should be. So, looks like it's gonna go into halftime with 0-0. Zero, zero. Nice. make a break here. Gavris. Darius Gavris. Pappas. Peters wins it. Back for Peters. There's Peters offsides. We go back to that no, no goal. I mean, this should be a one-nil game. Yeah, that is true. And even with Adams being as fantastic as he's been. Yeah. I get from the point of the uh, point of view from the ref, especially in the middle of the field, he might have not been able to tell, and he could have been honestly just thought it wasn't a goal. But from up here in the camera, we saw that that was a goal. So. Obviously, a lot easier for us <laughs> the replay. Pappas. Good cross field pass. Hopefully Sally's can just score and keep this game in their hands. So we won't have to worry about it too much. But if this does end in a tie or something like that, that would really be unfortunate. Or one a win from right school. Sal's in the corner. Papas will take it quickly. But it is almost like 
uh, Adams has earned it for his team. He's really been playing amazing. The ball in the box. No one can get a foot on it. He's had been some great corners too. Some nice opportunities. And that is the, the half. half. Thank you for watching. Come back in around 10 minutes and we should have the second half of this game up. Jake Adams keeping C. Milton right in this ball game. We'll be back with the second half. Thank you. It was all the way in, I can show you the video. It was all the way in, I can show you the video. Soon. By this much. Thank you. Thank you. I can text it to you if you want. Thanks, Coach. 856 745 4578. Okay, good. Well, we got to be on the line so we can see it. Not much in.
Welcome back to Abyssinia Stadium. I'm Shane Alexo alongside Brandon Bush. Brandon, big first half for Louisiana despite putting no goals on the board. Yeah, that was really an amazing first half. There are so many Louisiana shots on goal. It's really just um, Jake Adams, the goalkeeper for right school, just keeping things in a 0-0 game. There was the goal that should have been called as a goal, but the ref did not call it. It was a bounce out of the net, but Louisiana really is playing well, so hopefully they can just get in the back of the net. Maroney, John Luca Maroney, trying to pull off some Maroney magic. Maroney in the corner for Tommy. For Brentlinger. Back for Bittner. Tommy for Maroney. John Luca Maroney for Papas. AG Gonzalez. Beautiful skill there from Gonzalez. That was a great interception. Great tackle there. That was Travis Kozak. Kettleson. Hit Gavris right in the face. Gavris ate that. Let's go, boys. Let's go, boys. What is that? Looks perfectly fine to me. Kettleson. Tommy. Gonzalez. The flick of the head. Papas. Paris Papas. Papas. Nice Papas. Could be big. There's Papas. The shot. Another Great save goal. by Adams. Papas. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. The ball in the box. Duffy. Ross trying to get a shot off. Bit wide. <laughs> that was Gavish with the shot. Take a pass from Jake Ross. Adams will take the kick. Plays it upfield. Duffy. Pass it to himself, but it's out. Colin Duffy. See Milton Wright have a throw. Great throw. Old truck. Looks like Slesium defense is going to handle that well. Help from Bittner. Gavris. Gorgeous ball there. Foul caught on Tommy. Tommy did make, make contact. 
Yeah, the ball a, did the ball did draw him there. That was like a football hit, but I don't think he meant it like that. The ball did draw him there. Luke. Matt Luke. Bittner. Yeah, it looks like Wright's offense is being more authoritative this half. I feel like they know that they can rely on the goalie, so if they just play more aggressive on offense, they can get this in and win this game. Gavris. The header. Gonzalez, Aiden Gonzalez trying to send Ross. Beautiful save there from Adams. Come off his line. Intercepted by Gavris. Darius Gavris. Nice pass to Papas. Gonna go outside. Ibarra Sanchez. Her buyers will play it upfield. Hines. Ibarra Sanchez plays it upfield. No one there. Duraka. Duffy trying to win it back. He does. A plate upfield for kick. Ross. Gonzalez. They have Tommy if they need him. Making a run down the line. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. Lights through. For Tommy. Again, and Tommy. That's. Looks like he lost his shin guard. That was a bit too strong of a kick. I thought it was going to be a It is a throw. throw. It yeah, is a throw. Gavris going up for the header. No foul called. Maroney. Good step there. Tommy winning it back for Gonzalez, for Duffy. Ross, back for Duffy, the shot. Beautiful save there from Adams. Great hands there from Adams. Keeping this a nil-nil game. Yeah, that one looked a bit high, but still managed to save it. But that does give Slazian the chance for the corner. I guess it's better be safe than I think so. That can be Maroney taking the kick. Paris Papas will take the corner. Paris Papas and Brandon Abarra Sanchez in the corner. Ibarra Sanchez. Sanchez, the ball in the box, blocked. That looked like a nice play, but it was blocked. Ibarra Sanchez. Hines getting in there. Intended for Luke, he gets it. For Whitmore. Weak shot there, easy save for Bittner. That was a great play, but the shot was not there. Maroney has time and space. Gonzalez making a run, so is Papas. That's out. Gonna be a right throw in their territory. Maroney. John Luca Maroney for Duffy. Come on, Intercepted. Big. For Whitmore. A play it upfield. Bittner. Blasted upfield. The header. Gavris. Chested by Duffy. Maroney. Couldn't get there. Nice interception by Kettleson. Kettleson. 
Luke Ibarra Sanchez. Play it back for Pittner. Pittner in no rush. Neither is Hines. Coming up on 30 minutes left in the game, still 0 0. Assuming that the game does not end in a tie, because then it will go to overtime, since this isn't a this is an out of state game. Gavras. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. For Gonzalez. Quick turn. Ross. Jake Ross shot blocked. Luke, Matt Luke, Gavris wins the battle. Luke trying to win it back. Pappas, good cut there from Paris Pappas. Pappas, he's got Maroney down the line. John Luca Maroney. The shot, just wide. Yeah, most of the Slazian players have been on. It's really just the goalie that's keeping this game at tie. If you are Jake Ross, though, you got to be really stressed right now because you, you would think that you'd be winning, especially after that goal that should have gone in or should have been called. It really would be disappointing to see this game end in a slazing him loss or tie. Adams, played upfield. Especially the way they dominated in that first, first half. Duffy for Maroney. Yeah, but no matter what this game ends, and you really gotta give some respect to that other goalie. He really has some skill. Adams has been standing on his head in this game. I mean, Adams could be the key to their first uh, win against Louisiana in 20 years, you said? We'll see. Uh, 28 minutes left in the second half. Blazing him a corner from Paris Papas. Papas, the corner, the header. That's way too hard. Tyler Sifu with the header, I think. I think it was Maroney. <laughs> Adams plays it upfield, the header. Quick turn. They'll play it upfield. Brentlinger the header. Gavris for Brentlinger. Duffy will play it upfield. No one there. Gavris the header. Maroney, John Luca Maroney. He's got Papas. Maroney getting tangled Great up there. Cut. Gonzalez, Ross, beautiful passing there, trying to lay it off for Duffy. A little just miscoordinated. Almost too much passing there. Ibarra Sanchez. I mean, if every player was ready for that, that could have been perfect goal, but. Maroney. Not expecting that from Jake Ross. John Luca Maroney, the shot. Great shot. Even better save. Right at Adams. Yeah. But a lot of velocity. He has on some that of the shot. strongest shots from outside the box. That one was in the box, but. Good job, boys. Come on now. Keep it up. Let's go. Really a great shooter. Great hands there from Adams. I think Jake Ross typically plays or scores closer to the goal, but Maroney's, I've seen all his shots from outside. Hines trying to save that one. Adams 
as a goal kick. Let's go, let's go, get back, Will, get back, Will. Aiden, Aiden Whitmore, Whitmore coming on for C. Milton Wright. And he's coming in now for Sam Dragunas, I think. Gonzalez for Papas. Paris Papas, the shot. Go. Great. And there's the goal we've been looking for. Paris Papas beats Adams for the first time today, and Silesia Adams up 1 0. Great goal. What a shot there from Paris Pappas. Nothing Adams could do. It finally got around him. Puts his team on the board. So easy and him one. C. Milton, nil. That must have been some catharsis for Slazy and him after all those shots. Little sigh of relief there you would expect from yeah. Coach Mosier. All the built up. Not done, Energy. not done just yet. Ibarra Sanchez down the line. C. Milton Wright has a throw. After that many shots on goal, you gotta be pretty stressed out, especially after happened in the first half. But Slayton takes the lead officially with 24 minutes left in the second half. I really could see Slazian securing this win because it's not like uh, their defense has had much of a challenge. It's really just been their offense. So if they can just continue to hold it down, maybe have some players play a bit more back, looks like they should be good. Another goal would be helpful though. Pass was intended for Ross. See Milton Wright wins it back, the header. Tommy. There's AG, back for Gavris. It would be nice to see Duffy get a goal too though, especially that he's back and he's been having a great game. He has had a lot of shots though, so that's definitely a good performance. Off the head of a right defender. Duffy, back for Brentlinger, for Gavris, Darius Gavris. Trying to play Ross, miscommunication. Adams, a play up field. Beautiful ball in for Ross. Great kick save from Adams. Yeah, it just shows Adams really is ready for anything. There's been so many skilled shots from corner shots, headers, breakaways. He saved everything. Even rebounds, we have to get a second shot and he's done everything. Maroney couldn't win that one. Sal's of a throw. But if you're a rights coach, you can't be that mad at him for them one or, one or two. Right? It'd be nice to see how many shots the Lazy Nino has had. Pappas. Maroney for Tommy. Hines. Tommy. For Duffy, for Gonzalez, 
Back from Maroney. Great passing. John Luca Maroney for Duffy. Adam stoned him. Whole team playing great though. Can't really give it to just one player on Sally's team. It's been everyone. That'd be a great game. Yikes. Also, if you are interested, the Silesian and football team is playing tonight at 7.30. Should be the same channel broadcasting it. I believe they're playing uh, Caesar Rodney High School. Uh, Slazium homecoming game, so make sure to join. There's Schneider. Ball in. Shot from Caesar Rodney. Looks like Caden Rulo, Aiden Demitrakis, and another player are going to come on for Thomas C. Wright School. C. Milton Wright School. Bittner will take the goal kick quickly. Ibarra Sanchez plays it upfield. There's Ross. Back for Ross. Harris Pappas. Pappas, the shot for Great distance. Shot. Just high. Look like at Maroney took the shot right there. If that went in, that would have been one of the best goals I've seen from this team. It was almost there, just a bit too high. Papa's having a great game too, though. <laughs> Foul called on Gavris. Whitmore wants to take it quickly. Whitmore looking a bit angry after that one. Pass is intercepted. They want it back though. Ooh, 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 ooh. Duffy, excuse me, Brentlinger. Maroney for Ross down the line. Gorgeous ball there. Ross, the cross. Pappas, the quick turn. Paris Pappas, shot blocked. Sal's of a corner. The ball in. Another corner. Paulo Magat and Tyler Sifa getting warmed up on the Saudi sideline. Seventeen minutes left in the game. Sally's kick. The ball in. Beautiful ball there. Back post, no one there. Yeah, this is probably some of the best corners I've seen from them. A lot of the games they have been lacking. Not been able to get the ball in the box, but they have this game. Tyler Sifa and Paulo Magat coming, coming, coming in. Sean Duffy. Sean Duffy in. John Luca Maroney coming out. Adams will play it upfield. Sounds of a free kick.
Great run. Yeah, Everton intercepts it. With a nice slide tackle. Magat trying to win it back. Whitmore making a run down the line, couldn't get it to him. Magat has time and space. Paulo Magat. Pass was intended for Ross. Ross making a push. Didn't get to it in time. Gabris for Hines. For Magat. For Papas. Papas, Jake Ross, this shot blocked. And they are, it looks like they are double teaming Jake Ross when he has the ball, but that is leaving an extra player open, so. I think this was been able to let Sally's get so many shots on goal. Whitmore was making a run there, they couldn't get it to him. Brett Lynn's gonna switch the field. Pappas. Bit of skill there from Pappas. There's Magat. Paulo Magat, the shot. Brennan Adams. Ball played down the line. Well played by Brentlinger. Told me the header. We got trying to win it back. We got playing aggressive. They call a foul on him. Congrafon will take this free kick. Good crossfield pass. Good physical play there from Brentlinger to win that one back. Sifa, Tower Sifa. Ball was intended for Pappas. Nerd in the one two. Brentlinger plays it upfield. Great one two. It's Cornick. Nice coordination, but Papas will receive it. Papas for AG. Gonzalez. Looks like Sally's really wants a second goal to help secure oh my God. that win. Papas. Paris Papas. For AG. AG, the shot block. There's Magat. Wanted to get a shot off. The shot, right at Adams. Another one. Minutes left. Hines from Magat for Tommy for Papas Paris Papas. Ross 
Ross putting pressure on Adams. They'll play it out of the back. Looks like John Luca Maroney and Sean Duffy are going to come back into the game. Hines for Pappas. Good one two there with Magat. Beautiful ball there. Gonzalez the shot. High, high and wide. Looks like Mosier wants to keep most of the starters in just to make sure they hold up. Trying to secure a win. I mean, for Hines and Brettlinger back there, it hasn't been that hard of a game. But the people up front putting in all that effort, they must, they must be tired. Brettlinger has done what he needed to do in this game, so. My God, trying to win that one back. The flex off and they call a foul on him. Shirt pull. <laughs> Garaka. Jake Cross gonna push up. Crossfield pass for Peters. Bar Sanchez intercepts that pass. Duraco wanting it back. Duffy. Corner. It looked like it went off the right player, but I guess it's a corner. About eight minutes and 50 seconds remaining in this game. This might be one of their last chances. Rice School hasn't had many opportunities up in Silesium's box, but, but. Excuse me, it was indeed a throw in. Oh. And there's Paolo Magat looking to make something happen. Magat. Gorgeous ball there for Ross. See what he can do against his, against his Ross. breakaway. Well done by the C. Milton Wright defense. They call a foul on AG. Couldn't get it to him. Sounds of a throw. Magat takes it quickly. Maroney. Push. Gonzalez from Maroney. The ball in. Possible handball. No call. Maroney. Back for AG. Gonzalez blocked. Sal's of a throw. Lizzie and I'm not too happy with the ref calls this game. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. The ball in the box. AG. For Ross. That's a trip or something. Looks PK. like it's going to be a penalty kick from Jake Ross. This is another great opportunity to really showcase Jake Adams' and goalkeeping abilities. He can save this, and he's really demonstrated being able to save every single type of shot. Let's see if Jake Ross can make this a 2 0 Silesiana lead. Looks like Gavris will come back in for Silesiana when he has a chance. Jake Ross will take this PK. If this goes in, I feel like it's really the finisher for this game. Adams on his toes. Ross, the shot, go. That's him. Jake Ross. Jake Ross makes this a 2 0 Silesiana lead. Should secure this game with coming up on six minutes left in the game. What a goal by Jake Ross and Silesian leads 2-0. Nothing Adams could do on that PK. That should be a 
relief for Mosier. Maybe some subs will come in now. Looks like we have Brandon Abera Sanchez coming off for Darius Gavris. You'll see here on that replay, really no shot there for Adams. Guess the wrong way, and Ibarra Sanchez finishes the rest. Excuse me, Ross. <laughs> I saw his name come up. Yeah. No, he just came to the game. Whitmore. Dangerous pass, Ross. The quick turn, Ross, the shot. Adams the save. Really dangerous pass there from Whitmore. Ross almost taking advantage of that. Looking for his second goal of the game. Magat. As much as Slazingham has dominated this game, I, I'd like to say that uh, their um, Wright's goalie is really one of the best I've ever seen. Easily. Tommy, the throw. <laughs> Duffy. Good ball there from Duffy. Trying to find Ross. Miscommunication. Hines goes up for that header. Luke. He'll play it back. Wright getting a bit more aggressive. Pass intended for Luke. Duffy wouldn't have it. Maroney. Gorgeous touch there. John Luke and Maroney trying to find Ross. Ross shielding, from def shielding defenders. Gonzalez. Back the one-two back for Ross. Nice defense. That was a great breakaway, and they were able to put it down. Gavers trying to intercept that pass. Go, Tanner! Van P. Pass was deflected. Gavers up the line. Nice play from Gavers to save that. Pass intended for Sifa. That's what Lax is doing it to. Bittner settles that one. Around three minutes left in the game. Slazy and him up by two. Subs coming in. Looks like Declan Malloy and Colin McGee. Gonna go in for Declan, gonna go in for Ann and Tony. Brooks Benson and will come McGee on. McGee being restricted from coming in for the, for the time being. Brooks Benson will come on for C. Milton Wright. Holding McGee back. Gabe Cook about to come on as well. Magat for Duffy. Pass at the ref. I think it was going the same way it was. Malloy, the header. McGee coming into the game. Four. Aiden Gonzalez Aiden will Gonzalez. come off. Bringing the McGee card into the game this late is very surprising. This could ensure the third goal for Slesianum. Luke. Cook. Dragunas. Mistouched. Magat. Quick turn. He officially reached extra time. Luke. Magat trying to win that back. He does. Foul called.
Aiden Whitmore will take the kick. Would be nice to see them score. Whitmore, the ball in the box, headed away by Hines. McGee, just wide. He swooped in, pressure from him, I guess. Made the defender just kick it wide. McGee. Gavris to McGee to Sifa. Sifa. Back to Gavris. Darius Gavris for Duffy. Sean Duffy. He's got Magot. McGee making a run. McGee trying to win it back. Still in play. Hines. Back for Bittner. Fifty yard kick. Maybe more. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. Foul called. Maroney, McGee, Colin McGee, the ball in the box. Great ball there from McGee, unfortunately no, unfortunately no one home. Of course. McGee always stellar. Bittner, no rush. As I said before, as I come up to the close of this game, it's Lazy Hand football tonight at 7.30 against Caesar Rodney High School. Should be a big game. Make sure to, jo make sure to join back. About two hours. Malloy, Declan Malloy, showing off some skill, Malloy. Should South be the corner. almost the end of the game. It's been extra time for a little now. Maybe one last legs in the corner. Mickey in the box, watch for him. Maroney. John Luca Maroney. And that is the game. The Sals win 2-0 over C. Milton Wright. Great game overall, Brandon. Great game from Slazianum. Great game from C. Milton Wright too, especially Jake Adams. Got to give him some respect. Really frustrating Slazianum coaches, fans. Players, so many shots on goal, only two of them scored. One of Slay's strongest games, Pass, passing wise, skill wise. And they kept the effort to the end, didn't give up, and they got that win because of it. Yeah, gorgeous performance from Jake Adams. Allowed two goals, but had many, many, many saves along the way. Thanks for joining. I'm Shane Alexa alongside Brandon Bush for Bishop Wayne, Nate Reed, and Tommy Tyree. We'll Charles, see you. Charles Abernathy. And Charlie Abernathy. We'll see you soon. Make sure to join back later. Thank you.